Alright, hey guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming, and today I am going to bring you another video. And today's video, I'm going to talk about this uh, cool and new amazing software that I'm pretty sure you guys will like it. And it is um, actually quite very useful for mobile gamers, and especially me. Usually, I play Call of Duty or other mobile games, and while also preferring to play on my PC. So you can do that with this um, software, which is called the uh, uh, iMyPhone Mirror 2 software. So basically what this software does is basically it uh, casts or mirrors your phone's uh, screen to your PC desktop itself. So it's pretty cool so you guys can watch movie or what in a bigger screen or play your games in a bigger screen. And there's many more features which I'm going to show you um, shortly Okay, on how you guys can connect your phone to it and um, what, are the, what kind of mirroring they do. So um, it's pretty cool and um, yeah with, without further ado let's just jump straight into how it works. So let's go. Alright, so basically once you start up this software, alright, you can get to select your um, phone so you can support both iOS and Android, alright. So, um, once you have selected the phone that you are currently want to connect to, you just click on the um, Android one. So I'm using my own phone, the Samsung Z4. So I just get a cable, preferably if you want to use a, if you want less latency and a better quality, I would suggest you to use a USB 3.0 cable, alright. For me, this is a simple cheap cable, so... The quality might not be there, but so I just connect to my phone, right? And it will shows that it is char is charging, All right? As you can see right here, All right? And our desktop is already showed up, so um, so I just click on OK, and it's gonna um, um take my permission. So allows USB debugging. For this one, you have to enable. For Android, you have to enable that in your developer op option and on. Turn on USB debugging, but if you guys not sure how to do it, alright, there's a tutorial in the software itself that teach you guys how you guys can enable USB debugging. But I'm not gonna go through that. But for now, so we're gonna just gonna allow. And after that, um, alright, it's gonna connect it to your phone, and there you go. So, and the software for this, alright, it will automatically install into your phone itself. So once you connect your phone to it, it will install the Mirror Two software. So you don't have to download it from the Play Store anywhere. So you just click on start now and everything is in place. So um so yeah as you can see from the screen and my phone, okay, it's all mirrored, so it's pretty cool. Alright, all my uh, it's mirrored and you can watch YouTube with it. Alright, and what's cool about that is you can control it with your mouse. So you can control it with your computer and you can watch YouTube with your computer. And um, you can full screen it. So yeah, it's pretty cool. Okay, so that's how you guys can do it, and also it, you can also play play games with it. So if you guys want to play game with it, alright, you want to play games with it. Alright, it does support your keyboard, so you can use keyboard to play games. So you can play game. I'm gonna play like stumble guy. I'm gonna show you guys how stumble guys work. So I've already um put the WASD here. So uh, what you guys can do is when you click on this. Alright, you have the keyboard mapping so you can keep on the map the W I put the WSD here so that I can play with the joystick here. I'm gonna show you how you guys can do it. Alright, so as for now, okay. Okay. I'm gonna show you how you guys can do it while playing this game with um keyboard. So as you can see from the background over here, I have my keyboard with me right here. Shift it side. Alright. So I'm gonna control using my keyboard to play this game. So just jump button and you can use your mouse to look around, it's pretty cool. Alright, so you see I'm gonna using my keyboard to control it. You know. There you go. So it is that simple. I'm um, in this game I'm playing Stumble Guys, so yeah, it's that simple. You can use it, use your keyboard to control any games. If you're playing Pump G or what you can use it. <laughs> to uh, con control your game so as you can see it is a really cool piece of software that um, you know you guys can use it and you guys can watch videos YouTube everything with it is super cool as you can see the quality now is a bit um, a low resolution because that was, as I said previously I'm using a cheap USB-C cable if you guys use the cable that comes with your phone or a fast USB 3.0 cable Alright, the connection will be seamless. Alright, and um, 
and also um for this okay you also can connect it via wi-fi and bluetooth so you don't need to have a cable but there will be latency so i would highly suggest cable because if you're playing game the best if you have low latency so you can use it to control with your keyboard and mouse um it's so yeah so that's um that's this uh, i i my phone mirror to software so it's pretty cool you can, can mirror it all right you can control it with your computer and you can control it with your phone also as well so if you want a bigger screen uh, on your desktop on your monitor all right so um yeah, this is how it looks like i'm gonna show you guys to you guys how this looks like Right, um, on on not from the recording. So, as you guys can see, alright, it basically mirrors it from my phone. It basically mirrors on my desktop. So, so yeah, this is how um the Mirror Dot Two software works. It's pretty cool. So yeah, so I'm gonna talk about what what kind of software they have. Alright, what the features they have other than controlling your phone. So that um they you have screen recording, so you can record. Um, your screen um, using this software so it's pretty cool where you can take a s screenshot using your software so you're safe to your PC instead of your phone so if your phone is running out of storage you can use this to record your gameplay videos it's pretty cool for us gamers too so if you want to upload it to YouTube you can use this software to record it alright there's different settings alright you guys can change the different kind of different settings they have alright like um, you know all these kind of um, macro keys and stuff so so yeah they also got like um turn off screen all those kind of commands keyboard mapping is one of the best ones so you guys can you know use your keyboard to control your phone itself so yeah so um yeah so if you guys are interested you guys can go ahead and visit their website the link will be in the video description down below you guys can go ahead and check it out all right um they have the different type of offer and different sales for for this for this software itself so highly recommend you guys check it out and purchase one if you if you guys love this software and personally i myself love it a lot because i'm able to you know sometimes i don't have my time on my phone so i can use this basically to con to work on my phone all right i can work on my phone and at the same time you know i work on my own stuff on the computer itself so yeah this is one of the very cool software so um i would like highly recommend you guys to check it out and they are having sale right now so do go ahead and check the link in the video description down below once again and if you guys find this video helpful give it a thumbs up and uh if you guys like this video give us do give, remember give it a subscribe and um that's all for today and uh, thank you guys for being here and uh, i hope this video helped you guys out and uh, i shall see you guys in my next video peace out i don't want to cry